Hey YouTube, this is Tyler and I'm going to show you how to save your songs in Spotify as either WAV or MP3 files. Now the first thing you'll have to do if you haven't already is to download Spotify to your computer. Um, you can do it right off the website. You'll also need to download Audacity, which is a sound recorder that you're going to use to basically capture a song as it's playing and then save it. Now the first thing you'll want to do when you open up Audacity is to make sure that the microphone is selected to speaker or high definition audio input, whatever your sound card is, instead of the built-in microphone on your laptop, um, just so that way it records the direct audio and not a mic or anything like that. After that you can hit record, go to Spotify, and start playing the song or songs you want it to record. Now you want to make sure that the volume control is on about 75% because if you do anything higher than that, it'll either start peaking or just might be too loud compared to your other MP3 tracks. So once the song is done, or if you're like me and you chose to just have your whole library recorded, you'll want to select simply by holding down the mouse and selecting the portion that you want saved. So as you can see here, I have the portion selected. What you can also do to eliminate audio gaps is to zoom in using control 1 and go all the way at the beginning and just kind of see where it starts at and if you notice that it's a little further from where the song begins simply hover your mouse over until you see the hand and drag it over to the beginning of the song. You can do the same thing in the end as well to make sure that it ends and there's no silence afterwards. Once you have your song selected you go to File, Export Audio, and I like to title my songs with the artist's name, or the band's name, Dash, and then the song title. Once you hit Save, you'll have the option to type in song information. I'd highly recommend doing that so that way when you go to the songs on your phone, they're easily organized by artist and title, even the album if you'd like rather than just having it sorted by title and nothing else. For some reason, my computer won't save as MP3, it'll only save as WAV. So what I do is I'll save it as a WAV and then convert it to MP3 using an online converter or Windows Movie Maker, Adobe, whatever, just later on. So that's pretty much the gist of it. Um, it might take a little bit of time, but I find it worth it for me because I'm paying about $10 a month for Spotify Premium. Not a big deal when I first got it, but I'm not really downloading any new songs or saving any new songs, listening to any albums. I'm just kind of listening to the same songs, just like an MP3 player. So might as well export these songs as MP3s and put them on my MP3 player, cancel the premium membership and save some money. Um, it's up to you if you want to keep your Spotify membership or, you know, you just want to save a few songs on a different device. But hopefully this tutorial did you well and uh, thanks for watching.